Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm going to be doing a quick Tuesday morning haul and a Target Dollar Spot haul. So this first sticker that I purchased were um, 49 cents. There is a SKU and it is Thanksgiving themed. So I figured I could use this um, when Thanksgiving comes, of course. And yeah, there's a whole bunch of cool sayings and phrases that I could use for that. So these next stickers are similar to the Thanksgiving one. They're both by Gypsies, Seven Gypsies. I'm not gonna try and pronounce the name of the sticker or the collection, but they're uh, like antique kind of. I'm not too sure about this picture. I don't like pictures of people that I don't know, <laughs> especially from a long time ago. It kind of, kind of creeps me out, but that's just me. Anyways, um, these stickers are really cute. They were 49 cents. There's a skew. There's a whole bunch of cute little phrases that you could just cut up and use on a layout. This next sheet is grandparents themed by Seven Gypsies. And uh, it was also 49 cents. There's the skew. And I figured maybe I could do a grandparents layout for my daughter. And there's a whole bunch of cute stickers as well that I loved. So these next two stickers that I purchased are um, alphabet sheets by Seven Gypsies as well. It was 49 cents, there's the skew. And they are just alphabet letters in black. Uh, I really like them. They're small, they're not um, huge. <laughs> and uh, I also purchased in pink. It matches with that antique style stickers that I purchased. It's the same collection type. It's also by Seven Gypsies and I like the pink. So I just grabbed these two. I also picked up these uh, colorful box. Um, <laughs> they're $1.99, there's a skew. I figured I could just put some pieces of like ephemera in them. They're nice size. I'm trying to show you the measurement for them. Maybe like a two and a half by two and a half. Maybe inch, inch and a half or inch thick. And I like them since they're different colors and could use them for a lot of things. I have just a thumb on them right now, like I said. The only thing you have to look out for is the lid just comes off easily. Like there's nothing holding it back. But if I turn it upside down and like, as you can see what I'm doing, it doesn't fall off, but it does come off easily. So maybe I'll just put some like tape on it, some washi tape to hold it closed. I'm not sure yet. Just if you pick these up, just make sure you don't have anything valuable in it that might fall out. Uh, the next thing that I purchased were these mommy kits by me and my big ideas. It was a 99 cents. There's the SKU and the collection type, the collection name is Memories. Um, it came with two sticker sheets. It's kind of like a puffy sticker and then like chalkboard stickers. And then six sheets of paper. I would probably like to say they're six by six. Um, it's really nice that you can get like a pack like this and do like a little a little album with what you have. So I picked out a couple of these. I'm just going to be opening this one to show you what they look like. I won't be opening the other ones. And yeah, uh, these sticker sheets were stuck together so I had to cut them apart. I'll show you on the back. As you can see right there, that plastic. It was holding the two sticker sheets together but this is what they look like. And this is everything that comes in the packet.
for this next uh, mommy kit, me and my big ideas mommy kit. Uh, the name is Travel. And let me correct myself, they're actually eight by eight sheets, not six by six, sorry. So this is what comes in it. It's like adventure theme, sailboat, anchors. It's really nice. And then this last one that I purchased, uh, the name is Zoo. It was 99 cents. The ski is right there. And I used this on a layout that I made. We took my daughter to the zoo probably about like a month ago. It was really nice outside. And I like the way it turned out. I used some of the stickers and I think it turned out great. So I'm happy that I purchased this, these stickers. Uh, the next thing I purchased were the Studio Calico die cuts. There's 51 vellum shapes inside, in size, bleh, inside. They're $1.49, um, and this is everything that came inside of it. I'm not gonna be opening it just because everything is on the back of it. And I mainly got it for those arrows. I'm not sure what I'm gonna use them for, but we'll see. So um, that was the end of my Tuesday morning haul, and now I'm gonna be doing um, just a quick mini dollar spot from Target haul. Um, just some like 4th of July things that I found so first thing I purchased was this bandana. It was for a dollar. It's square like that. Um, I was thinking of using it maybe as like a headband of some sort. I'm not too sure yet. This is what it looks like. It's very, um, it doesn't feel like bandana material. It's kind of smoother. Uh, let's see. Oh, it's polyester but I thought it looked nice, so we'll see how that turns out. That was for a dollar. I purchased this paper banner that has um, American flag, so it looks like that. That was for a dollar, and this is how big the flags are. I could put it on my ruler, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's seven inches, one, two, three, four, four and a half. It says um, 60 inches, I'm guessing, is the length of this string. And then next thing is this other paper banner. I bought a couple paper banners. This one says stars and stripes, 60 inches. So it's cut out. It was for a dollar. And this one is one, two, three, four, about four and a half inches long. Four and a half inches wide. Four and a half inches wide, sorry. That's what that looks like. Purchase this uh, other paper banner that says America on it. 60 inches for a dollar. And there's circles. One, two, three, four, five, about five inches down. Well, you get the picture, it's a circle. I purchased this DIY paper banner, so you can tie like banners to hang up. I'm gonna hang up one of these on my um, front door. Four glitter stars, four chevron pennants, and one piece of jute twine. So the twine, the stars, and the flags, the pennants. And then the last two things I purchased were these stickers for a dollar. Just 4th of July, let's party like it's 1776. Home, America, I thought these were really cute for um, a 4th of July spread. And then just these paper flags. Super cute. So that's the end of my haul. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And hope you guys are having a good day. So I'll see you guys next time, bye.